I travel to the far reaches of the globe in search of wine knowledge and great bottles. I recently took a trip to Virginia to check out some of the state's top producers and oh, I left impressed. Not only does American history run deep in this eastern coastal state, it's also the birthplace of American wine with grapes cultivated since the 1600s. Thomas Jefferson kicked it off at Monticello and it's taken until the last decade or so to perfect it. The modern era of Virginia wine began when Barbersville was founded in 1976, and there are now over 200 Virginia wineries. Grapes are planted in seven distinct regions, from an hour outside Washington, D.C., to the Chesapeake Bay, and the Charlottesville area to the Shenandoah Valley. The warm, humid climate has proven challenging to some varieties, but others shine, including reds like Cabernet Franc and Petit Verdot, and whites like Viognier. I became enamored with the sparkling wine and the unique bottlings from bone dry to super sweet of the grape Petit Mensang. Now it might be hard to find the wines outside Virginia, but it's worth a trip to taste, tour, and visit. Ugh, Thomas would be proud. <laughs>